Well, from breast cancer survivor to comforter, this morning's 7 Everyday Hero has quite a story to tell. I went to UC Health Cancer Center in Fort Collins to find out it involves an invention you may not even know about. When Deanna Krause began knitting as a child, I'm totally addicted to it. She had no idea how important the pastime would become. I don't know what I would do without this. Two years ago, she was diagnosed with stage two breast cancer. A double mastectomy and treatment left her feeling lost. You really lose everything. You know, when you have breast cancer, you don't just lose your breasts. A lot of times you lose, you might have to have your ovaries removed. You are put in menopause, you know, early. So. A lot of that femininity goes out the window. Fortunately for Deanna, she found Knitted Knockers, a national group connecting knitters and crocheters with breast cancer survivors. Together, they create handmade breast prostheses for women, giving them a free alternative to the often uncomfortable and costly medical ones. When you're diagnosed with cancer, there's what we call financial toxicity, and people are trying to choose, do I feed my kids or do I get a prosthe prosthesis, which is hundreds of dollars. So she's like, don't worry, you can feed your kids and look good. All of the yarn and time is donated, but the real magic happens during community knit-a-thons, where volunteers come in as total strangers, but leave as a tight-knit community of women helping women. I cried quite a few times that first knit-a-thon because it was so, it was love of women. I don't even know who these people are, you know, and it was a wave of love, like we, we've got your back. Today, the Northern Colorado group has expanded to hospitals and plastic surgery offices throughout Colorado, most recently helping women in Africa with options and education. I think part of her success is just her energy and her enthusiasm and just the impact that she has on other people's lives. The group has helped thousands of women, but for everything Deanna gives, it's what she's gotten back that's been most healing of all. I felt like I was picked up out of that darkness and just taken straight to um, not only feeling like a woman again, but feeling like a part of a community that I, I knew I could always tap into. I wasn't alone anymore. We have a little surprise for you. Me? Yes. <laughs> we brought everybody here today because we would like to honor you as a seven everyday hero for everything that you do for Knitted Knockers and all of the cancer survivors. Oh my God, that's crazy. <laughs> oh. I got to give a special thanks to Nicole because <laughs> she helped me voice that package last week. Oh, when I, that story when I lost my voice. It's nice to have your voice back. It is. <laughs> Power. To nominate a hero in your life, go to thedenverchannel.com and click on our community section and then seven everyday heroes. You never realize how much you talk until you